Hello everybody, for those of you who know me, welcome back. And for those of you who don't, I'm Pia and I'm your host for all things Lux. On today's video, I am bringing you a beauty and fashion miscellaneous luxury vlog. What do we have on the agenda? First off, I've been invited to the Hermes private invitation only sales. It's my first time ever going in Paris. I've been after this silk triangle scarf. So I'm really hoping it will be available since the stock they have, it's all from past collections. And I actually even get a plus one. So I get to head there with one of my girlfriends, which I am so excited about. I've also been invited by the Cinq Mondes Spa at La Samaritaine department store to go try their latest Covido Royal anti-aging and natural lift massage treatment. Then I'm having a day with husband. We're going to go try a new restaurant, do a little bit of shopping and just hang out and be lovers in Paris like we love to do from time to time. I received a couple of purchases, so I thought I'd share them with you. This first one in here is by Monica Benader. It's going to be a pair of earrings. So this is what the packaging looks like. It's my first time ever getting something from Monica Vinader. So far, I like the packaging because you have two different compartments, one for each earring, so they don't rub off on one another, but also so it's not that bulky and you can easily carry it for holidays. This is what the pair looks like. You might see whatever you want to see. A coma, I actually see a little whale. So the whales on the symbol of the larger department where the city I was born in is at. So I'm really fond of whales and to me it looks like two little whales but in reality it's inspired of a Romanian artist named Brancusi and hope I'm not butchering his name. I will insert it down below in case you want to check out his pieces. I always find him so intriguing and they awake some sort of peace when I look at them. I will obviously be trying them on. I'll most likely be wearing them during my stay in Paris. They're 18 karat gold plated. So that's the first thing I wanted to share with you today. And then the next order I wanted to share with you is from May Paper and Co. Stationary brand. They do mainly minimal inspired designed stationery. Look at the type of everything they do is so appealing to look at. I really really like this brand. What does it say? Passion fuels purpose. I Oops. I absolutely agree with that. You should always follow whatever sets your heart on fire. So in here, they've included some lovely silver foiled stickers. They've also included a January card. There's a lovely thank you card with a little cute quote. This ones, which are actually the markers I use on my agenda. So this is the one I had from last year, 2023. I was still using this one because I was waiting for a new order to arrive. Are going to be this one right here, which is a one page sized calendar for my Louis Vuitton GM agenda. This is what I use as a cover for the agenda. And then most importantly, this one's right here, which are going to be one day per page planner pages. On this one, you get the date, the day of the week, the month and the year. And then you're going to get a priorities list, a to-do list, a timeline based list as well. And then a notes section at the bottom. And what I love about this one is that the paper is very, very smooth to write on, but it's still quite thick. It's thick enough so the pen or the marker that I'm using won't bleed onto the other side of the page. I really, really love this one. And then as a cover for every single single month. I will use this one. And what they have is a goal planner. So you're going to have what is your goal? Why is it important? Action steps, etc. And then for any sort of targets or goals that I have for that particular month, I'll put them in here. What else they have? I mean, I didn't order this one this time, but Anyway, they'll also have some blank pages like this one. They also have some YouTube ones. Great for planning content. Stationery is something I really enjoy and I love the idea of supporting a small business when it comes to getting it for this agenda. I'm a big honest fan of this brand. Thought I'd share it with you. So I will link it down below as in everything that I'm mentioning on this video. And I'll see you tomorrow when we head to Paris together. Bearless face, and I'm just headed to La Samaritaine to test out the new Covido Royal treatment by Saint Monde. Really cannot wait to see 
how they perform this one because it's a treatment that I absolutely adore. And when performed in a good manner, it's an instant lifting to our face without any surgical intervention. Here's the cabin ready. This was our cleanse. This was the essence we used after. It was a pre and probiotic essence. Then moving on to the Geto Supreme range. This is the serum we used, and this is the cream which you've already seen me talk about. Um, as you know, it comes in this beautiful compartment. You've got your tool in there with stainless steel, and then the wonderful cream. I don't think we're gonna be able to take it out but anyway absolutely gorgeous as a presentation and even nicer on the skin because that's going to help us with the production of our own collagen Good morning. I have Tristan with me in here today and I've also got my new little gadget. So you're either going to be listening to me now or this is not going to be working. I'm going to have to do a voiceover after. Anyway, we've just arrived to Kubi and I'm going to take you to what's been named four times one of the best, if not the best, Lebanese place to have food at in Paris. Food has arrived, so here we've got some hummus, some lentils with fried rice, golden grilled onions, and we've also got some grenade. Then in here we've got the kafta with the tomato sauce, the latne, um, radishes and dark olives and herbs as well. We've got the choufleur that I cannot remember the name right now, but I'll try to write it on the screen for you. And it looks absolutely exquisite. We're also still waiting for a couple of dishes, so I'll show you some more in a second. Last part has arrived. We've got the potatoes with a little bit of a tomato sauce, some spices, and they look absolutely delicious. Everything looks absolutely delicious. Pita bread, some white wine, Lebanese wine, and we've got some red Lebanese wine. How was lunch? That was totally delicious. <laughs> And now we're headed to a boutique I really, really love in here. It's called Sir, And I love the things they do. I'm pretty certain I've done like one or two hauls from them because I have a couple of pieces from them here. Do a little bit of Paris, do a little bit of shopping. Monsieur wanted to try a Rolex, I think. Bretling. Ah, uh, the green one of Bretling. Okay, so we have to find a little watch for him. And that's why, right? right? The shoes and the handbags, everything's so pretty in here. Let's have a little look at the pictures I'm going to be testing. We've got this one in here, which is a gorgeous sort of salopette in a very dark military green. Hello you guys, we are back from Paris. 
matchup of lipstick. This one's Chanel Destination in number 174. Absolute favorite nude lippy. Now, Paris was really, really hectic. How cute are the earrings? Should we start by the unboxing? I received from Intuise one of the most exciting things I've ever gotten from them. As you know, I've been working with Intuise for over a year and this part is not sponsored at all. However, this is something that they did send me for a collab we're doing later on this month. It's a new product they've launched. They're coming out with beauty fridges. Intuise products are actually enriched with NAD+. We could call it the youth molecule. It helps in skin cell rejuvenation. It helps us to produce a little bit more of our own collagen, to get rid of fine lines. Everybody that tries Intuise around my entourage has absolutely loved it as much as I do. As you know, I've never done Botox or anything like that. So far, so good. Now, the thing with the NAD plus molecule is that it's going to be better kept in a beauty fridge or just in your regular fridge. Those of you that are regulars in here will know that I keep my Intuise products in my fridge. I don't have to anymore. So they're coming out with these fridges. I haven't checked mine yet. So you're seeing it here first with me. They're coming out with plugs for the US, the UK, and the European Union as well. How are we doing this? I don't want to break my fridge before I get to even use it, but this is going to be so good. This is gorgeous! So this is what it looks like. This is the Intuise mini fridge. Okay, so they did send it with an EU plug. My everyday ones, I could keep them on the door, and my extra ones, I could keep them in here. I don't know. I'm gonna have to see how I do it, but I'll definitely be filming a let's fill my Intuise fridge together. And I think this part is glass, or at least it, it seems like it. And I love how the color of it matches the colors of the Intuise creams, which is so pretty. Thank you so much to the lovely girls at the Intuise team. I am certain this is gonna have so much use. And to be honest with you, Javi will be so happy that he gets to have back that space on the fridge. For the MS sale, you won't have seen me record anything because cameras and phones weren't allowed in there. I didn't end up getting as much stuff as I would have liked to. And the reason for that is that I already sort of allocated some budget for other projects and expenses, let's say, that I have coming up in the next couple of months. However, I do hope I get invited to invite only summer sale that I'll do because for that one, I'll prepare a much larger budget. I did end up finding something I was after for years. Also yesterday when we went to Sœur, as you will have seen already on the vlog, Javi actually did a little bit of a princess treatment. He took me shopping after lunch, had some lovely Lebanese food. We shared so many dishes as you will have seen and they were one more exquisite than the other. Everyone was so tasteful and deep and complex in its own way while still remaining true to the nature of the original dish, but they still had a little bit of a twist or extra bonus added to it, which I really, really enjoyed. And now let's talk a little bit about the Sank Mon Covidou or Covido treatment I had done at their spa in the minus one floor beauty area of La Samaritaine. As many of you will know, La Samaritaine is one of the most prestigious, luxurious, and renowned shopping addresses here in Paris. They were closed for about 20 years or 15 years to get reformed, refurbished, and after a huge process of renovation, they reopened to the public. They have all of the nicest brands in there. The building itself is worth paying a visit. It's absolutely exquisite. It's got a very enchanting architecture, which is a combination of Art Nouveau and Art Deco, and I am always in complete Oh, when I visit. So if you're ever in Paris, I highly, highly advise you go pay a visit to them. And if you're in the mood for a little bit of a relaxation, a facelift without getting any sort of injections, any sort of invasive treatment, Le Cinq Monde Spa is the place to go to. Every detail on the experience incites your mind and body to teleport yourself to another part of the world. I was firstly welcome with a detox tea, honey bush, African mango, and rooibos. Very light, calming music starts to make you travel as well. And then every sense starts to get appealed to. I was then promptly tended to by Sylvina, who had God's 
hands. We actually had a brief chat before the COVID treatment started in which I told her about my adapalene treatment and about the general sensitivity of my skin. She took this into consideration and still performed a COVID that as soon as I came out, I could see my eyebrows were more lifted. My overall face expressions are a little bit more lifted. My jawline is looking a little bit more defined as well. When it's well performed, people around you will comment because it actually looks like you've had either injections done or anything like that. And it's really just a massage, but it's not just a massage, it's the massage. They will come in with a chart that's got all these different colors and ask you to pick one for the treatment. So you pick a color without knowing really where it's going to lead. And then after, that color actually is liaised to a scent of the house. In my case, it was vanilla and cardamom. And then that instantly has you traveling as well. And then the massage starts. And COVID massage, I, w I don't want to call it violent, but it's an almost not aggressive, but it's a very rhythmic and strong massage to experience. If it's your first time ever having one, I highly, highly advise to not have used anything that makes your skin a little bit more sensitive on the night before. I personally pause my Edipaline treatment for one or two days before I'll do a COVID treatment. And the beauty about it being done at the Sank Mont Spa is that they'll use their highest, most luxurious creams and serums from the Geto Supreme treatment line in order to perform the treatment. So you're not only getting all of the benefits of the massage that's going to sculpt your face and lift your face, you're also getting the benefits of their most sumptuous anti-age treatment creams and serums. Now I have to admit, while I was having the treatment done, I was a little bit puzzled because I didn't experience that type of pressure that I'm used to receiving from this type of treatment. Once I finished, looked at myself in the mirror and saw that the results were there, I went ahead and asked her, how did you do that? And so what she explained is that due to the natural sensitivity of my skin, the adapalene treatment I use at nighttime, and the fact that we're in a very cold moment of the year where you go inside, it's heated, and then you go outside, it's cold. Different shocks of temperatures all day makes it a little bit more sensitive. So she said pressure has to be adjusted to each and every single client's needs, but also to the outside temperatures. And that was very interesting because I could actually experience a pleasant sensation while receiving the massage. It's quite a strong massage, to be fair with you. Nothing painful, like I wouldn't do something painful, that's not my style, but it's a very vigorous and energy charged massage type on a regular basis. And this time it was just a little bit more toned down. I'm very, very happy with the result. I feel like you can really see that there's this part that's been a little bit more lifted. Definitely there's a little bit more definition on my chin area, as well as having my eyebrows a little bit more lifted as well. Overall, a gorgeous experience. The team was absolutely lovely. Highly, highly advise this address. I will link the address on the description box down below for you. And I'll also add the name to Sylvina so you can actually book it with her because I tell you her hands are like a little goddess's hands that will sculpt your face in the most gentle but still defined way. Yeah, I'm gonna end the vlog here. That was it for this time, you guys. Thank you all so much for watching. Watching. And if you're not done, I'll leave you two more videos after so you can binge a little bit more. See you on the next one. Bye!